harmonic mean should be used instead of uh, arithmetic mean or geometric mean when uh, data are represented as a um, uh, ratio. For example, um, price earning ratio or price to book value ratio. So perfect example of showing these uh, when you calculate the market price earning ratio. Uh, imagine that in a market, there are only uh, three companies, say uh, company A, company B, and company uh, C. So company A has a market cap of 1,000 uh, taka, uh, company B has a market cap of 3,000 taka, and company C has a market cap of uh, 4,000 taka. Uh, and their respective price earning ratio is 10, 15, and 12.5. Uh, that can be calculated by uh, taking the uh, price of the share 20 divided by 2 is 10, uh, 30 divided by 2 is 15, and so on. Uh, another way of calculating these is equal to, uh, for example, market cap, taking the market cap 1,000, and divide the uh, net profit. So 1,000 divided by 100 is uh, 10, and 3,000 taka market cap divided by 15 is uh, divided by 200 taka net profit is equals to uh, 15. Uh, so if we take the total market cap, uh, so it will be around, um, it will be 8,000. And if we take the total net profit of the market, it will be uh, 620. So what should be the uh, overall uh, price earning ratio of the market? The market price earning ratio should be 8,000 divided by 620, which is equal to 12.90. Now, you are given three um, price earning ratios, 10, 15, and 12.5. What will happen if you take the um, normal average, like you sum all these numbers and divide it in, divide by uh, three. So if you plus 10, 15, and 12.5, when divided by three, then the average uh, rate of return or arithmetic mean will be 12.5. Certainly this is not the answer because the market P is 12.9. So in that case, uh, you have to take weighted average market cap because uh, all these company, company A, company B, and company C are not same in terms of size. So if you, if you take account uh, of this size difference of the companies, uh, you can take the weighted average um, uh, arithmetic mean, 12.5 is the weight of company A, uh, 37.5 is the weight of company B and 50 mm, is the weight uh, of company C. So if you take the weighted average number, then still the average uh, weighted average arithmetic mean will be 13.3, 13.13, uh, 13 um, which is uh, not uh, equal to 12.9. So certainly, uh, again, uh, this is the wrong answer. This is the wrong answer. So how can we uh, come up with the right uh, market price earning ratio? It can only be calculated using the harmonic mean uh, because the uh, data are represented as ratio because price earning ratio. So we have to calculate the weighted average harmonic mean. So weighted average harmonic mean, to calculate weighted average harmonic mean, we need to multiply the respective uh, weight by the reciprocal of the uh, P ratio, which is one by 10 uh, into 12.5, one by 15 into 37.5 and so on. Uh, and then we have to take the reciprocal one divided by this number and this number should uh, come up 12.9 uh, and this is the uh, average price earning ratio of the market. So um, uh, when data are represented as ratios, uh, we need to use harmonic mean uh, instead of uh, general arithmetic mean or instead of uh, geometric mean.